Hey guys, Cullybot3 here and welcome to episode 1 of a little mini web app trading series that I plan on doing on the few short days before FIFA 13 Ultimate Team actually comes out. So basically I'll be giving you my trading insight and knowledge and everything that I will be doing on the web app in the days leading up to FIFA 13 coming out will be posted up on my channel. So I hope it gives you guys an advantage and I suppose a head start on everyone else who's only going to be... Uh, accessing uh, ultimate team when the game actually comes out so anyways you'll see in front of you my trade pile and they are all the players that i got out of the packs that i opened up when i started on the web app so they were my free packs if you missed uh, that video it was up on my channel a couple days ago i'll leave a link on the screen and one in the description below so go check that out and yeah you will see that i have mascherano skulls gargano a couple of them players and i'll show you how much you should put the player up for. So researching the price. And this is vital at the start of the game. Especially in the web app. And I know this is the absolute basics. And so many of you know it. But some guys are just starting out from new on FIFA 13. And they are novices. They are they are new to the game. So you have to give them a chance. If you already know this. Don't worry. Uh, I'll go through it really quickly. So you'll see there. I do a broad search of Mascherano. Just to check his, the rough price of him. And the price will be fluctuating. Going up and down during the web app. Because so few coins are around. And there's just not that much to put around I suppose. But anyways, I will search for his lowest buy now, just to check what it is. And it was indeed 4231, which was actually the one that I had in my trade pile that I pulled out of a pack. And it was 5k buy now, so I did list it for 100 cheaper, hoping that I will sell it. So 4,900 was the bin that I put Mascherano up for. And the funny thing was, he actually did sell straight away. I mean, within, I think, 5 minutes, and I was thinking... Maybe I could have got a bit more from, but I was thinking that the prices players were going to dramatically drop as the game was out, as more coins were in circulation. But hey, I was happy to get 4,900 off them. But you will see that there are a couple of players missing, like Mascherano and Skulls. And for some reason, they did disappear. I did sell them probably about a day and a half ago when I did start on the web app. And uh, I don't know, I didn't click on them. I know clicking on them does uh, make them disappear. But anyways, I did sell Mascherano for 4,900 and Skulls for 2,400. And yeah, that was the price I sold them for. There is a lamb in there in the mix of everything. Because when I was selling the players, I did end up picking up a lamb. But we'll get back to that later. Anyways, there are a couple of players that didn't sell. You'll see there. And also, uh, one of the two Udinese badges didn't sell. And that is unfortunate. But uh, hey, I'll keep trying to relist them. And if not, I will discard them. They are close enough to, to their discard price. But when I am going to get stuck into trading and showing you guys uh, trading techniques, I will be probably quick selling them. So I do have the available funds. But anyways, you will see there that that is the lamb that I picked up. It's in 41212 for 10,500. Now, the lowest buy now, right as I was doing this video, was 11k. And that was for a very bad formation. So I'm figuring uh, it probably will go for maybe about 5 or 6k more than that. And I was even going to wait till the game came out and maybe sell them then. But anyways, I did stick up the rest of the players from my club. And that is key, guys, if you want to release, uh, I suppose, get funds into your uh into your web app account because you want to be selling your most valuable players first because uh, they will be depreciating in price as the web app comes out. They probably will go up a bit when the game comes out. It's hard to tell and uh, I suppose only a uh, somebody who can predict the future will know uh, what the price of players are and whatnot. But anyways, yeah, I am uh, undecided on what I'm going to do for Lamb. Uh, you'll see him there. I don't know. Uh, will I sell him now and free up funds? I am being a bit of a uh, hypocrite. In keeping them, even when I told you guys that you should be selling all your players out of your club to free up funds for trading. So let me know what you guys think, what I should do with them. Keep them and sell them on the first few days that the game comes out, or maybe sell them right now. So let me know what you think, and that is pretty much it for this first episode of my little mini trading series. I do hope you enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to leave a like, a comment, and all of that stuff. Anyways, have a good day, and I'll see you next time.